Welcome back to another Fort Friday. Today, for the first time ever, we have the Plinko board set up in front of the store. We are gonna be taking turns dropping the Plinko ball down the board, and whatever the ball lands in is the section you have to make your fort in. Also, quick thanks to Life After for sponsoring today's Fort Friday. So for today's bad fort locations, we got toys and clothes. Definitely don't wanna get that. And then obviously good forts, you wanna get toilet paper, diapers, strollers. Those are all great options. Let's see what we get. Hyper, you drop first. Got a new thing for you right here. This is going to be train gang. Oh, toilet paper! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, what the? That's Fort <laughs> Turtle mode activate. Dude. Okay, I'll take it. All right, Night Vision Army. I saw your guys' comments on the last budget challenge saying I need to retire Night Vision, so time for a new one. Activate brain power now. Whoa. Please, Please. Don't, don't fail, fail me. me. No. Oh, Garden Center. Garden Center. I don't know if that's good or bad. I have no clue. All right, let's go to the store. All right, we are in the store now, so we are all three gonna go to our separate sections and start building our forts. And keep in mind, the first one to get caught is the ultimate loser. So probably Garden Center boy. Really? <laughs> yeah. Watch me. Okay. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> so I'm trying to find my section. I don't know where the dog food is in this store. I washed by the toilet paper. There's like none there. Guys, you've got to be kidding me. These are barren everywhere. Not not a place to hide inside. What what, what is this? How am I? What? We're done, boys. <laughs> Who got me this? I'm gonna get caught for sure. So Hyper is gonna have a really hard time even just making a fort. We thought toilet paper was the best, but it ends up being the worst. Right now is a great time to talk about today's sponsor. Life After is an open world survival game that is free to play on iOS, Android, and PC. Life After is developed by NetEast Games and the game has been downloaded over 200 million times and was voted most competitive mobile game in 2019. In the game, you can explore all kinds of landscapes from deserts, snow-capped mountains, forests, and islands, and travel to any of them with no loading. And you can explore this vast world different vehicles like motorcycles, SUVs, and even helicopters. You can hunt, you can scavenge for resources, you can craft materials for survival, you can build your own campsite, kind of like building your own little fort. While exploring in the game, you may encounter and have to fight off hordes of zombies, which means you have to make a decision. Decide wisely on what different class you want to be. You can choose between either a combat master, a professional miner, a skilled craftsman, treasure hunters. You decide. But keep in mind, you will always have a dog as a constant companion to keep you company. New players who log in will receive a free motorcycle, a free customization card, and a profession change card. So with all that being said, we have four challenges for you guys. Explore the world, survive doomsday, rebuild your society, and take back the world. So download Life After in the description right now. Use that link. Life After supports our channel, supports our content. So guys, download it and see what you think. Thank you, NetEast, for sponsoring this video. Link is in the description if you want to download the game. So I got the garden center. We have never made forts in the garden center at the store. So I have no idea how I'm going to make this work. We have made it to the dog food. They're pretty well stocked. So I think we can make an excellent fort. I think maybe this section here, move some of that back into the front, build walls, enter, and we win. No way, guys. They literally have the Christmas decorations out. I can make Christmas decorations fort. Guys, um, maybe I should just get an, in a Nintendo Switch instead. Huh? People think I'm so pathetic that they're not even wondering why I'm here. It's so sad. Fort basically built. I've got to go to the bathroom before I get in there because that might be a big L if I don't. So this is turning out better than anticipated. There are literally no customers back here. I haven't even seen a single employee yet. And I have a ton of space, literally this entire section. So I'm gonna look around a little more, see if I can find any unique spots. And we're gonna build a dope fort. Just hanging out, hanging out in here. Just don't move. Don't move. Nobody move. I think I can go in now. Just kind of looking. Oh, employees. Just looking for dog food. Wow, twenty-two ninety-eight. What a great deal, maybe. Let's see if I can see anything different back here. Okay. Gotta get right 
right there. Oh, not bad. I can get pretty low, and I've got some pretty high walls here. Not bad. So for my fort, guys, I'm gonna be building it right behind this Christmas wrapping paper. I have gotta outdo Hyper. He's got the toilet paper section. I think this might be able to do it because there's plenty of space back here. Look at this. Got an entrance. If I just move some of this stuff, it'll be a sweet little hideout. That was close. I was an employee scanning stuff. I thought they were gonna come by my fort, but they didn't. So I don't know how Hyper is doing on his fort because I know there's basically zero toilet paper that I saw. So I have no idea what he built. You guys aren't gonna believe this. When I was in the bathroom, the employee came and took like five or six bags of dog food from my section, put them on a cart and zoomed away. Oh, why did she do that? So check it out guys, I got my walls built and my fort stands out because I have a secret entrance right here where the hoses are. This is the only way to get in. So anybody walking by, they won't see me. All right, new strategy. Maybe if I'm so incredibly slow in moving, no one will care that I'm here. You know what I mean? Hi. Hey, how's it going? What's going on? Yeah. <laughs> well, we were supposed to be hiding, but didn't know there was going to be an outage of toilet paper. So you can't hide if there's, can you make yourself a little fortress? I tried. <laughs> I tried. Guys, it's kind of weird. They, it's like they just think I'm so awkward they don't want to look. That's okay. Oh well. Okay, I think the coast is clear. Let's go inside. I'm inside the fort. Nothing has fallen over yet. It's just kind of loud. I haven't seen Justin since we left. Really curious to see where he built his fort as well. Look how clutch this is, guys. Completely hidden in the Christmas wrapping paper. Somebody's very close. Dog sounds. Use the floss. Why does Sean have to go to the bathroom? <laughs> Guys, I've discovered something amazing and I'm gonna put it to the test. Since I've been inside the toilet paper fort, or lack thereof, it entered me into another dimension to where I can't be seen by anybody because I'm so pathetic at building a fort. No one wants to notice me or care about me. So I'm gonna walk through the whole entire store. No one's gonna even know I'm here. It's amazing. This spot is so clutch, I can even sit up comfortably and have plenty of room. And I can see out in case employees or customers walk by. So there are some people around me, I think in a different aisle. I'm gonna start making some dog barking sound effects to see if it confuses them. This is what it's like to be a ghost. Supernatural presence. Amazing. I think I'm gonna get out of my fort and go see what the other fellas built. And then maybe I can get some decorations or some comfy stuff. And must have snacks, so gotta get snacks as well. It's like the whole store's mine. I could sit on one of these things. Amazing. Oh, rah, rah. oh it's sad. <laughs> <laughs> I confused Hyper so bad. <laughs> Ow. All right, so I have no idea where Justin's Ford is, so I'm gonna see if I can find it without him telling me. Hyper already knows, but. I'm not telling. You're not telling? Employee right over there. Oh no. I'm guessing he's back here, no? It's too full. There's no way you're back here, man. Hello. Oh my. <laughs> what the nuts? Hey, bud. What the heck? So do you move this for cover? I don't even need cover. Oh. I need zero. How are you guys doing today? I'm doing good. <laughs> what is that? Justin keeps barking by the employee. I don't know how he's not getting caught. <laughs> So you're doing all right? Nah, I'm doing okay. <sighs> you found me. Oh. 
Well guys, as you just saw, I got caught. I wanted to get out of my fort and Andrew was filming me and then out comes the bleed. Ah, I thought he wouldn't get caught. I gotta get snacks in my fort, right? Yeah, okay. we'll see who's gonna win out of you two. Gotta get back to being invisible. He's invisible. How am I gonna be in visa mode? <laughs> So Justin got caught. I'm still gonna try to get these snacks and go back into my fort. I just gotta outlast toilet paper hyper boy. Right, guys, I came back and all of the toilet paper has shrunk even more. I don't know where all these things are going. Pull you right there. Again, I think as soon as I go inside the empty, oh, empty fort, it activates this invisibility cloak. Have been people passing by back and forth? Nothing. Also, is the apocalypse happening? Where's, where, where, where are all the things? What's, what, 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 what? Ah, oh, all right. Snacks acquired, back in the fort. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. It worked. Invisibility cloak. No one can stop me now. I'm like Harry Potter in that one thing. Yeah, I think I get out of work at like three or four. There's multiple people in my aisle. Oh! Ah. Ah. <laughs> I was trying to get her attention. I should have said something else like dad, I guess. Well guys, it's all over. Got the whole row to myself. Also, let's talk about this mustache. Uh, truth is, guys, I didn't uh, wear the train costume like I should have. I couldn't find one. They're all sold out for Halloween, so I figured I needed to punish myself with a mustache. So here I am. Um, you know, so here we go. Here we go. As you guys can see, we are wearing the brand new Must Have Snacks 2.0 edition. Look what we got here. We got pretzels, donuts. This is super epic. If you want to get it available right now, chase2shop.com. Get yours out. Guys, we got this in the bag or in the box rather. <laughs> they probably think I'm crazy. How's it going? And uh, you know, it's great being invisible and all because no one knows that you're here. Are you coming in too? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, nope, you're fine. Guys, she apologized coming into my fort. I'm telling you, man, it's ultimate power when they feel awkward and uncomfortable. It's fantastic. It's us, Andrew. Who is this? It's Justin and Hyper. Oh, hey, sorry. I don't know what to do. I think you win. I win? Yes, the employee found Hyper. He didn't technically get in trouble, but she found him. Yeah, it was That's true. really awkward. And then I felt super uncomfortable. Everyone was staring at me, so I kind of just forfeited. Yeah, no one has found me in my fort. Not even a customer, so I guess I do win. Yeah, you're the winner. Ugh. Now I just got to get out of here. Employee stalking right over here. <laughs> Thanks again, Life After, for sponsoring today's fort video. Hey! Link in the description. Let us know what you want to see in the next Plinko Board Decides Fort Challenge. So Justin got caught, somehow Hyper was invisible, and I didn't get seen by anybody, so I think I won. Yeah. Well, if you like this video, click up here. You're going to like these other videos, and as always, make sure you're live daily. We'll see you next time.